Hi, I'm Rob Reed with RBD, and I'm gonna do a walk around today with you guys on a Bay Point 644 FDQB. Let's get started on the outside. The Bay Point 644 FDQB, as you can see, comes standard with two huge slide outs. We are an eight and a half foot wide destination trailer, and we have opposing slides in the front living room. Look at all the big bay windows that you have there on the outside of this bay point. And uh, we're gonna now look down through here and you get your 30 pound LP tanks with a cover. Uh, all of our bay points come standard with a detachable hitch. So you can take it off once you get to the campground. We got stabilizer jacks, you got a battery box, not needed mainly when you're there. One of the cool features is here that we have a battery disconnect out on the A-frame of the unit, so it's very easy to shut off the, the uh, 110. As you can see, we're going to walk around the outside here, slide out room. Notice how we finish off our slide outs on the outside here. You have no wood showing, and then underneath, you have a nice undercoated, clean looking slide room floor. Uh, we use a triple seal slide system, as you can see there. All the way up to the top keeps the water out and squeegees off the water on the way in if you notice there we also have awning rails with two inch drip or drip gutters up there we use 8500 or 8800 series max airflow windows all of our metal on the outside we use them is uh, 030 metal a lot of our uh, people use uh, 024 there's your bay point Two 7,000 pound axles are standard. A 40,000 BTU furnace is standard. We are fully wash and dryer prepped and that's the vent for it on the outside. This is actually the master bedroom outside part of the slide room. Notice up here at the top, uh, it's hard to notice in the daylight, but that is an LED security light. It's right over the top of where you guys are doing the termination system at. Back here we have our water inlet, 50 amp service is standard, you got your cable and satellite prepped area there. If you need to have further information you can go right here to rbdrb.com, you can go right to our website. This is the back side of your 644 FDQB. On the front side here, we have your hot water heater. We use a 20 gallon hot water heater standard. And again, on the back door here, we've got another big security light. Your power on it with an LED light strip. Which covers the both, both entry ways, your patio door and your rear door. I don't know if you can see it, but two 15,000 BTU roof air conditioners with a heat strip on it. We're going to go right in the front door here, your patio door. Get your four step entry here. And we're going to come right into the Master Chef kitchen. If you notice in here, we have our huge cubic foot refrigerator there, stainless steel. Lots of counter space. This is kind of a U-shaped kitchen, so you got lots of kitchen cabinets. Notice how we have the raised panel fronts on them. You have a 30-inch residential microwave oven. You have a huge 30-inch residential range. It's also got pots and pans storage down below. Storage down below here. You got three drawers there. You got under sink storage. We have a huge uh, double bowl stainless steel sink with a pull-out sprayer faucet. Your new sink covers there. And again, we have lots of storage space, lots of counter space. So when you're sitting here doing dishes, you can actually still see the TV and be in communication with uh, anybody else that you might be entertaining at the time. Speaking of entertaining, you have a lot of storage space or a lot of seating space here. You have a trifold sofa there, a trifold sofa there, your entertainment center with big bay windows, and then you have theater seats here with cup holders in them and a little 
compartment in the middle to store your TV remotes. You also have a table and four chairs here. Each of our chairs comes standard with a storage area in between. And again, you have lots of storage here above your theater seating and above your dinette table area. I just turned on a couple of lights there that weren't on. One of the big things we use is a, the 5050-8800 series max airflow windows. You get 50% of airflow through these windows. So if you notice, all of our side windows and even the bay windows in the front actually open up so you get great cross ventilation. One of the other neat features is we come standard with a ceiling fan with light. You get your 15,000 BTU roof air there. You got your fireplace with a DVD surround sound, sound bar. And you can get a 50 inch TV sitting up there watching the football game and still being able to see out your front uh, bay windows there. Looking from the living room back to the kitchen area, you got more storage on this side of the kitchen sink, kitchen counters. And again, you have lots of storage in this bay point. Coming down the hallway here, you have your command center, which you can do your slide out rooms, your tank uh, sizes and all that kind of stuff, your awnings, slide outs. Again, you get more windows coming down your hallway here that actually open up. Here's your second entry door that goes directly into the hallway to the master bedroom and the bathroom. You're getting a quick glimpse of the master bedroom, but we're going to move into the ba uh, bathroom area. Here you get a nice big bathroom sink with storage underneath. You get a residential faucet there, nice big medicine cabinet. And again, what uh, RBD is known for is our fiberglass showers and tubs. We don't use any of the two-piece plastic, which some of our competitors do. This one actually comes with a nice glass shower door. You get your porcelain toilet place to hang your towels, another medicine cabinet, and then you have a huge area here for linen storage, but it is also it's adjustable shelf, so you can adjust it however you want, but it's also our washer and dryer prep, so a full size stackable washer and dryer can go in there. Moving into the bedroom, Again, we have a nice big tabletop here, a dresser that you can put your TV, 32 inch TV, another window that opens with cross ventilation. You got four drawers underneath there. You also have overhead cabinet storage above that area. Moving around past the door, you got a nice big queen bed here. Uh, we actually have the drapes pulled because of the sunlight, but nice headboard. Again, overhead cabinets, USBs and outlets on either side, and then you have your huge closet in the back. Again, more drawers down below, so you have ample storage in here. This is a destination camper, so you'll just be staying here for a long time. Nice mirrored closet doors with an abundance of storage on the inside. Nice places for folded clothes, hanging clothes, all the way back. And then that back there is an access panel to get to all your uh, breakers and stuff like that. So it's been my pleasure to show you the Bay Point 644 FDQB. And if you want to get any more information from it, you can just reach out to us at rvd.com. RV